Hi, this is Victor with Scooter Map, and we're going to be going over tracked locations. So you're probably going and picking up scooters at night when there are a lot come, becoming available, but scooters also show up during the day. Uh, right now, you have to, or right now you have to check the apps all the time to see if there are new scooters around you. Uh, we want to make this really easy, so we've set up tracked locations. Uh, when you track a location. You put an address and then we check that every few minutes and send you a push notification if scooters show up nearby and ready to charge. So you don't need to be checking the apps all the day. If a scooter shows up near your home or wherever else you're tracking, we'll send you a push notification and you can pick that up for some easy money. So let's see how that works. We're going to click on profile in the bottom right and scroll down to the tracked location section. So here we see we already have a tracked location, 2780 California Street, but let's add another. So let's say 587 post, sure. So click that and you see here we can actually also set the radius of the track location. So if a scooter shows up outside of this zone, we're not gonna send you a push notification. Um, if you have a car at home, you can set this to a larger location larger radius if you're just picking up scooters on foot you're going to want a smaller radius then we can also choose the companies that we're keeping track of so let's say here that we only charge for lime and we'll go in and we'll create this location now we'll scroll down and we'll see track locations boom we see 587 post that's all set up for us and that 2780 california street was set up before um, let's pretend that we don't want to uh get notified of new scooters near there. So we can actually click on the text there. That'll take us to the page where we, if we want to, we could edit the location. But let's just say, hey, let's just delete it. So we can click on remove track location on the bottom. And now when we scroll back to track locations, we only have one. So hopefully this is a useful feature and it'll help you make some more